Paso Bible girls have a history of state titles, the last one coming back in 2005. The Panthers try to get back on top in 2020. They have to go through St. Luke's Episcopal to make it to the finals. Mars Hill enters the game 28 and 8. Wildcats are 22 and 4. First half, Panthers clicking on offense. Riley Vaughn heats up with a pair of threes. Now Mars Hill out in front by 11, their largest lead of the game. And at the half, they're leading 33-25. I thought we did a good job. Neely did a good job. Kylie did a good job kicking the ball out. Mars Hill coach Jay Mitchell says St. Luke's made the right adjustments at the break. Combine that with Mars Hill shooting only 18% from the field in the final period, we have ourselves a ball game. Kylie Tickpin quickly gets this three off to tie the game at 58 with 12 seconds to go. Wildcats have time for one more play. Elizabeth Roebuck gets the ball. This is for the win, and she banks it in at the buzzer. Final 60-58. Mitchell explains what happened in the final seconds. They shared the basketball. Total team effort on their part, getting it down the floor and uh, getting tough the last shot off. I don't know how she made it. So. The Panthers didn't make the state finals, but Erica Mitchell is proud to represent her school in the final four. Love Marcio and I'm proud we got the opportunity to be a part of it. The Panthers do graduate five seniors this season. We'll have more state championship action coming up tonight at 10 on Way. Reporting in Birmingham, Lyndon Blake, Way 31 Sports.